<laughs> Coming home and just having them crawl all over you is pretty cool. I call my house the Island of Misfit Toys. Welcome to the inside of the island. Plenty of dog beds for everybody. We're just kind of like our own little family of one-offs. It's all fun and games. I'd love to be covered in chihuahuas. They are the second most euthanized breed right after pit bulls. I kind of made a pact with myself that you'll never have to deal with that again. I have my kennel license and everything like that. I have a really good relationship with Animal Control. And I have gates to gate off certain rooms if necessary, but for the most part, the entire main level of my house, I've remodeled for them. Can I just get some love? I don't want to just save them from dying. I want to teach them to live. My friend can't you can keep her dog there temporarily. And I said, sure, no problem. It was known that the dog wasn't that friendly, especially men, she didn't like them. So that's Lady. About an hour and a half later, and Lady's sitting in my lap. She's my best friend. And she's been my best friend ever since. Going through a divorce. Yeah, you know, I was pretty broken up over this. And so Lady's the one that kind of nursed me back to health. Kira, she absolutely hated me. She bit me. But I was like, this is the way it's going to treat everybody that comes to the door. What kind of chances does this dog have, you know? 15 minutes after this, in my lap, in the car, she's my alpha. She's been inseparable ever since. And then the cases just got harder and harder. It just started growing. The next thing you know, if somebody's tagging me in this, or they needed me to go help out. That's Buggy. She's one of my real special cases. He just came from the doctors. Thor, he's my little greeter. He welcomes every new dog to the house. Texas Pinky, she got on the side of the road in Texas, almost hairless. She was incontinent, diabetic, blind. Emergency vet tells these people put her down. That was in August. Now, her diabetes is under control. She's grown all of her hair back. And on her cataract surgery, and she can see again. <laughs> oh, rub the butt, rub the butt. Somebody had to tell me this. They said, remember when you were a kid, somebody convinced you that if you wanted to and you tried hard enough that you could change the world. You might not have to change the world, but she changed the world for this one dog. And then it became another dog and then it became another. That validation to me, man, you know, I was feeling pretty rough about myself. <laughs> These little ones have saved me. I could never give them as much as they've given me. Like, comment, and subscribe.